You're watching UNICEF Television. At a rural health clinic in the remote Karakal, Pakistan region of western Uzbekistan, monitoring the growth of children who have suffered from a deprived environment but now showing signs of improvement. The family doctor here, among a number who have received UNICEF-supported training on child health care, aimed at making them more effective physicians and counsellors. The main problem here has been children who are underweight and below normal height. But now we are taking regular checks on growth development and counseling the mothers on giving proper nutrition. Western Uzbekistan is blighted by the environmental and health hazards of the shrinking Aral Sea, and child health and nutritional indicators have been among the worst in the country. In response, UNICEF, together with local partners, adopted an ambitious plan of action with access to quality health and nutrition care the main focus. Through the training of health professionals who then influence key decision makers in families such as the grandmothers. They measure the growth of the child regularly and depending on how the child is doing, they give advice on feeding and so on. Uh, to reaching to the household level, go and talk about the importance of breastfeeding, importance of early child care, recognition of danger signs, visiting the health facilities and the regular immunization of the children uh, so that the children are benefited. With these health visits to ensure continued health, eight-month-old Hermiza was also delivered into the world thanks to baby-friendly techniques of newborn care. The maternity units of hospitals in this region have undergone a radical transformation. I have been working here for 29 years, and our hospital has been through several programs, including breastfeeding promotion and the baby-friendly initiative. And child morbidity has been reduced, as well as breast-related illnesses in mothers. Nursing her second child, baby Arman, just one day old, mother Gulnor has seen the difference. The first time, my child was taken from me straight away, but this time they gave the child to me and I felt much happier. The region of the country this baby has been born into facing challenges of disparity, poor nutrition and disease, but at least enjoying a start in life that offers hope. This is Rob McBride reporting for UNICEF Television. For more information, go to unicef.org. Unite for Children.